New this morning, we're breaking down the latest COVID-19 testing options to help you find out which test might be best for you if you're sick. It comes after the state reported the highest number of new COVID-19 cases in nearly a month. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott spoke with an expert about the benefits of each test. While the demand for COVID-19 testing has gone down some since the holidays, experts tell us they're still seeing a steady stream of people who need tests wanting to know which one is best. Experts suggest if someone is sick or they've been exposed to someone with COVID-19, they wait at least two to five days from exposure before getting tested. One of the testing options is a rapid antigen test that can give you results within 10 minutes. Another type of rapid antigen test is a PCR test. That's the one if you're having surgery or you're traveling, especially internationally, a lot of times they will require a PCR molecular test. This is considered the most accurate sensitive test. Many times places have to send that test off to an outside lab to get the results, which is why it can take days sometimes to get those results. But Palm Harbor Pharmacy is one place that has purchased the machine, so they're able to process their own PCR tests, giving you results within 30 minutes. And the last testing option is the antibody test. So that's a finger stick. Uh, and just with a drop of blood, we can see if you have antibodies in your blood. Now, all this time, we've been testing people for antibodies to see if they've had COVID. Well, what's really cool now is if you've been vaccinated and you do the finger stick blood test, you will show antibodies. And for more information on COVID-19 testing, make sure you head over to our website, abcactionnews.com. Reporting from Tampa, Larissa Scott, ABC Action News.